I'm always talking about using your training, using working out as a tool. And one of the big tools is having and developing extreme resilience. Whether you're working on a goal, you're trying to build something, you're going through something, resilience, 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 resilience is going to be such a key factor, a key component. You know what? I want to build a better me. I want to build a better physique. You don't have to have your back against the wall or when something traumatic happens to you, that's when you decide to get on your shit and like, okay, let's work. No, no, no. You can start building that right now. Seeing any results, it's not going to be short term. It's going to, you have to have long view and you don't really see anything in the beginning. Even though you're advancing and you're growing and you're getting to a, a better position, a better physique, a better look. You know, you're not, you're not going to see anything. It's just like investing, you know, you're not really seeing the returns in the beginning, but you know, Hey, I need to be doing this. I need to be, you know, depositing, depositing, and you got to deposit into yourself. You got to invest into yourself because as you're working on yourself in whatever category you're want to get more financially situated, you want to get a better body. You want to be in a position, be in a position that you can take care of your families the way you want to, the way you know you're supposed to. It's going to take some resilience. It's going to take hard work. It's going to be a grind. It's going to be a struggle. It's, there's nothing going to be given. So those moments when you want to throw the hands up, those moments when you don't want to be disciplined, more times than not, that's where it counts the most because that's where you're really going to get battle tested. So start approaching the gym, not only as this is a chest day where we're just working arms, approach it as this is a, another day to better myself. This is another day to strengthen my armor. This is another day to become stronger and not in the physical sense, stronger in the ways that people don't see with their eyes, but become stronger in your actions, become stronger in your word, like not breaking protocol, not breaking the promise to miss the workouts, to miss the gym. And in tune, you stop breaking promises in other aspects of your life and you keep the word to yourself or you keep your word to those that you love and you keep pushing forward. And what is all of this, you know, encapsulating, I guess we would call it. And that is just extreme mental fortitude, mental fortitude, mental fortitude. That's something that I scream. I want you guys to burn it in your brain. Mental fortitude. Doesn't matter how strong you are on this bench. What's your deadlift? Creating that mental fortitude. It's a fortress. Your mind is a fortress. And the walls are just getting stronger. Okay? You got cannons facing, you know, on the outside. So when all of those things try to penetrate that mindset, the issues, the problems, the stress, the fatigue, all of that, the doubt. It's like, okay. We've been waiting for this. We've been practicing this. We've been building our fortress for this. 
we're not hoping it comes, but if it does, we're ready.